Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hello and welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoy my painting videos. So today we'll be painting an egg. Okay, I have I have a lot of egg paintings and egg painting tutorials because I just love painting eggs. Every time I feel like doing something nice but not so difficult, I think eggs are just my go-to subject. All right. So I'm going to tell you first the colors that we'll be using for today's painting tutorial. So we have here titanium white, red, burnt sienna, black, and lemon yellow. Excuse the the rest of the colors on my palette because I used um, some of them or a lot of them in my previous videos. And as you can see here, my canvas is already painted gray. So I suggest that you paint your canvas I'm sorry about my voice. <laughs> so I suggest that you paint your canvas paper gray as well because we'll be doing some eggs on a pan. So the usual colors of a pan is black or silver or gray, something like that. So I suggest that we use the usual color so that the painting is more relatable. Okay, so I'm going to sketch first the subject. <laughs> Anyway, I did the background because I want to save some time. I don't want to waste your time watching me do the background. And the drying time is also a waste of time if you just watch me dry the, the canvas paper. <laughs> so I'm going to sketch first the subject. And for the sketch, I'm going to use a small brush. I'm going to get my yellow. I think my paint is already dry. I think it's a little, look at my hand. It looks a little messy. So I'm gonna try to sketch now the subject. I think the middle section is still wet, but I don't, I don't mind. I'm just gonna make it work for me. If it doesn't work, then we'll just paint over it. I'm gonna get my yellow, but I think I'll be using a little bit of orange. So I'm gonna dab onto my red to get some orange. So it's like this, and I'm going to start creating the yolk. So the middle section is really wet, so I'm trying to be gentle with my uh, brush stroke here. I don't want to blend the gray with the yellow or with the orange. So it's just a round little thing in the middle. Okay, like that. All right. I'm going to get my burnt sienna without washing my brush. I'm just going to get my burnt sienna in white. Okay, I'm gonna add a little bit of black. I don't know, my voice is quite coarse. Okay, maybe this color. Okay, maybe add more yellow and burnt sienna. Okay. We're gonna do the eggshell, the broken eggshell. So this is a broken egg. Is that the right word? Broken egg? All right, like that. And then we're gonna do the same thing right here. So everything will be all lines and shapes. We're not gonna do any detailing just yet. We're trying to get some shapes. All right, like that. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, like that. Now we're gonna do the egg white. So for the egg white, I'm just gonna wash my brush out. I'm gonna get my black. And then start sketching the egg yolk. I will explain later why we're using black when in fact egg yolk has no, it's basically transparent. You know, I did the thick background, that's why it's still wet. Okay, right here. Okay, like that. And then using black, okay, same color, I'm just gonna add some shadows. Gonna go around the egg yolk. Okay, and also here. Okay. okay, using some white, I'm gonna uh, dab onto my white and I'm gonna make some blending. Of course, fingers. So just blend, okay. Okay, just like that. Okay. Also here.
Okay, like that. <sighs> okay, using more black. Okay, just like that. Now we're gonna we're gonna do the egg yolk before we do the eggshells. Yeah, because the middle section is already dry. So for the egg yolk, I'm just gonna get my orangey color that we already had when we sketched the egg yolk. So I'm just gonna use it and paint it. I'm gonna add a little more red. Okay, that's the first layer. I'm gonna do the second layer using the same color. Okay, I'm gonna add more red to make it more orangey. Okay, just like that. And I'm going to allow this first to dry. Let's move on to the eggshells. I'm going to get my burnt sienna without washing my brush. I'm just going to allow the colors to mix together. And maybe black. And using this color, I'm just going to paint over the shell sketch. Okay, the same thing right here. Okay, I'm gonna get more brown and maybe I'm gonna add a little bit of red to that brown. Yellow. Okay, just like that. 
and then let's wash up a shout. So I'm gonna get some gray. I'm gonna mix my white and black. Maybe this, oops, the red is mixing. I don't have any more space on my palette. This is just an improvised, pa improvised palette. So I'm gonna get my gray, maybe this gray, or maybe a little more gray. More gray. Okay. And I'm gonna paint the insides of the eggshell. I'm gonna add a little bit of brown. Okay, I'm gonna try this color. Okay, let's try. Maybe this is too light. I'm gonna add more black. Basically, the color of the background. I think this is basically the color of the background. So, what I'm gonna do for it to stand out is to do some highlighting. Okay. So I'm gonna get again my gray, only that I'll be adding more white. Let's use this. Okay, like that. Also here. not yet done definitely okay using some black I'm gonna darken this area Right, and also the bottom part of this eggshell. To give it dimension. Okay, using some black. I'm gonna do some dark colors. To suggest broken shell. Okay, and since we're at it already, I'm gonna get my black. I'm gonna create some shadows.
Okay, like that. Right. Okay, where where um the painting is already making sense. Okay, I'm gonna change my brush. I'm gonna use a more pointy brush so that I get some um lines and details more accurate. So I'm gonna get my white. Just create some highlights. Okay, around the egg yolk. Yep, something like that. Oops. I touched the uh, wet paint, it's okay. Okay, more highlights. I really think this is an easy, super easy painting. Alright, and using this white, I'm just going to highlight the edges on the eggshell. Okay, just like that. And then using this white, I'm just going to spread some highlights right here. Okay. Also. Right here. Okay, we're not yet done with the yolk. Okay, let's save the best for last. Okay, using black, I'm gonna redefine some parts of the eggshell. Okay, I need more black.
이렇게 okay, using black I'm just gonna re-outline some some detailings Now I'm going to gray those highlights that I did. I don't want those to be pure white. Okay, let's separate the egg yolk from the eggshell. Very subtle uh, definition. Um, now let's go to the egg yolk because it looks a little flat. Okay. So for the egg yolk, I think it's already dry. We're just gonna get again our yellow and paint from the center. I'm gonna add add a little bit of white okay I think I'm just gonna use my finger to spread the colors evenly and now let's go back to using our orange we'll blend right again orange i'm gonna add a little bit of burnt sienna Okay, let me check okay it's more dimensional now compared to earlier I'm gonna wash my brush out ok 
Okay, I, I need more white and yellow. more orange the key here is to just keep layering keep layering You will notice that the, like this portion, the topmost portion is lighter and then the bottom is darker to give it more dimension. Okay, like that. And now I'm gonna add more detailing. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna wash my brush out anymore. I'm just gonna get my brown and white let's lighten okay that's too light i'm gonna add water just like that and also here Okay, now let's go back to our pointy brush and let's make some outlines. Don't make those outlines super thick or obvious. Make them quite subtle. You know, as much as possible, I don't outline it, but in this case, since it looks a little flat against the background, we need to outline. I'm gonna use some watered down black and I'm just gonna spread some of that color right here. Also here. Okay, just like that. More dark colors inside the shell. but water down, okay. I'm 
Okay, just like that. I'm gonna lighten this area again to give it a little bit of dimension. Oops. Some highlights around the edges. Okay, just like that. Okay, and then using this wide, I'm going to go around the egg yolk again, not too much. And let's create some highlights. Okay. Let's get some pure white. Some of the yellows are mixing. I want you to also observe how I'm doing it.
Mm -hmm. Let me check. Oh, this looks nice. But I have to redefine the egg yolk because I think um, some of the paints went outside the sketch lines. Okay, just like that. Let's emphasize more the egg yolk. I'm just adding more yellow, glazing this egg yolk more. Okay, I'm just obsessing over the egg yolk. <laughs> Okay. Oh, this is so much better. Let me check. Oh, this is nice. Okay. Let's get some light browns. Just highlight uh, that part nearest the crack.
Okay, like that. Okay. Let me check. Okay, it's nice. So using black, I'm just gonna glaze. I mean glaze, okay. And then white. We did a lot of um, gradient effect for this egg painting. Black to gray to white. And then yellow to orange. And browns and reds. A lot of gradient. Okay. Okay, just a little more highlighting and we're good. I'm going to brush over this area, highlighting it even more. Okay, and then more highlights on the shelves. Okay. Just like that. Just a few more touches and we're good. Oh, this is very simple, but I like it because uh, it's my favorite subject. So I'm just going to use some more highlighting. Okay. This looks nice. Mm -hmm. What do you think? This is so good. Mm -hmm. I think this is nice already. Let's just make the outlines more solid. Okay. 
and then using some more gray let's create some gray color I'm just gonna go around the shadow Okay, just like that very subtle we don't want the shadow to be uh, too harsh mm -hmm, just like that I just soften the shadows Now to give more light, I'm going to use some white and I'm just going to spread some of that color on the bottom. Let me check. Oh, this is very, very nice. Okay, I think I have to sign this now. We're all good. I will sign this now, and for the signature, of course, I'm gonna use my white. I'm gonna sign right here. Okay, this is a very simple um, painting, but I love it <clears throat> because it's it's an egg. Okay, so we're done. We're done guys i hope you enjoyed this one and i hope you do this one as well if you're painting along with me let me know in the comment section below and if you like this painting let me know as well mm, by the way i'm just gonna add a little more detailing i feel like it's lacking Okay, something like that. It should not be pure white. Alright, that's way better. So again, if you like this video, let me know in the comment section below. If you're painting along with me, let me know in the comment section below as well. If um, you want to share this with your friends, share them on your so share this on your social media account so that they know that I exist. And see you in my next video. Love you.